Hey guys, Will on YouTube here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your first staff. So let's go. I to file a new project, a view base. This is the type of app it's going to be. And we're going to name it First Staff. First Staff Ever. So where you can sit, this is where you want to save it to. So I'll save to my desktop and do save. So let's expand and click the arrow on the classes and the arrow in the resources. Make this a little bigger. So let's go into our first step of review controller dot h and do a IV outlet of a UI label space star label. Um and do a IV outlet of a UI text field space star text field text field okay and then do a IB action of set text field text to label text and then do a uh, actually this needs to be colon ID send sender then colon okay so now we need one more of ID action of alert colon ID sender Okay, let's save and go to our first step at reviewcontroller.xiv. So the first thing is what I'm moving right now is what your what when you test the app what it's gonna look like. So what we're gonna need to do is find a label, a text field, and just drag them onto the screen and then find two buttons. So on the label Let's highlight the label and go into our um, inspector and see if you see something called font, just double click that thing, they should pop up and make the font 72. Okay. And then drag the text field up here and in the um, Inspector and placeholder, click that and do name here, please. Okay. And, um, give me a second. Okay, so, in the first box, just gonna make it a little bigger. And then do set, and then in this one, do alert. Okay, so double click the label and delete the text. So, highlight file zoner and go into our second tab. The outlet under the outlets, if it's not there, oh. so um. In the outlets, just click these two arrows. But if they're already open, just let them be. So label goes to our blank label. Text field goes to our text field. Alert goes to the alert. Touch up inside. Set text field to label text. Goes to set. Touch up inside. Save and quit. Okay, well, copy both of these IV actions, command, and go to our first step at reviewcontroller.m and paste them. So, the first one, you're just going to delete that end colon and do open bracket, free enters, close brackets. And on the second one, do the same thing, open bracket, close bracket. So, 
in the sent text field to label text colon ID sender, just we're just gonna do um label dot text space equal space bracket n s string string with format this should pop up do enter and do at quotation quotation percentage at comma after the colon open bracket text field text double bracket semicolon so save and um in the alert do ns string space star um title so ttl space equals space bracket ns string string with format at quotes percentage at comma open bracket label text double bracket semicolon so then do ui alert view space star alert space equal space double bracket ui alert alert view lock and then do in it and this should pop up do enter title is going to be at quotation actually no the title is going to be ttl message is going to be at quotations so this is what we want the message to be um so do cool name and delegates gonna be self cancel button titles would be at quotes dismiss other button titles are gonna be um nil close bracket semicolon so then do bracket alert show close bracket semicolon then do bracket alert release close bracket semicolon so actually we're gonna do one more thing do a ns string space star um message so do message space equals space bracket and a string string with format at quotes percent at comma open bracket label text double bracket semicolon so before the at, at per percentage before the percentage at do um wow percentage at space is a cool name okay so in the message instead of doing that do m e s g because that's what we named it over here so let's go ahead and test this so click build and run up here and drag it out of here and you'll have this so we do name here oh i forgot to do something go into our view controller.xiv really fast again and make everything as high as possible so make the alert button up here and then the label is also going to be up here okay save and quit and now press the build and run button so the iphone iphone simulator will pop up so you name here please um i'll just do a bunch of random letters so new set so that changes it to the label text and if we do alert the title is what we put in the name wow and it says, wow, is a cool name. This is. Now you can change it. You can double click it and do select all. And delete. 
and do I'll do Bob set alert Bob. Wow, Bob is a cool name. Thanks for watching and subscribe.